Hey guys, welcome back to what's going to be the brew room. Uh, basically it's just a quick video about the problems I've been having uh, with the IPA Cooper's kit. And it's not a problem I've been having with it, brewing it, because I've not brewed it yet. It's confusion over the ingredients. Uh, basically the woman in the shop gave me brewing sugar, me, gave me a kilogram of brewing sugar. And uh, when I got it home and opened the instructions up onto the on the can, uh, it said recommended ingredients: dry malt extract. So I had a look on the internet, and a lot of you who have been brewing the Cooper's IPAs have been adding uh, dry malt extract. So I sent a few emails out and uh, found a good uh, website called BrewUK.co.uk. And they've got a forum on there which I've joined. And they asked the question, do I do I need the dry malt extract? Uh, the answers that come back are uh, the, the dry malt extract and the sugar are used in the same way as feeding the yeast, which gives you your, your alcohol. Uh, if I've got that wrong, let me know. Uh, so basically you can use the sugar or the dry malt. Uh, and somebody actually said if, you, if you're using one or the other, if you substitute in the dry malt extract for the sugar, then do it pound for pound. Um, he also said that the sugar would work with the brew, but the dry malt extract would give me a better body brew, it would give me a better brew. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do is, I'm going to uh, go back down to the brewing shop sometime this week, I'm going to buy the dry malt extract, uh, the recipe actually asks for uh, 500 grams uh, and hopefully Thursday night I'm going to brew the batch up. Uh, so yeah, until Thursday I'll, uh, I'll make another video. So yeah, thanks uh, for watching, if you are watching and uh, don't forget to leave your comments below. If you've got any help, please you know leave it below, uh, or any questions uh, about what what sort of equipment I've got to start out with, you know, just leave them below. And that's about it. So until Thursday, I'll uh, see you guys, and uh, don't forget to subscribe. Hopefully, the more people that subscribe to me, I can sort of ask them questions and sort of learn on the the hobby, you know. Uh, hopefully, my my goal is that by Christmas time I'll have brewed a Christmas ale uh, so I'm wanting to use grains and boiled grains and you know add the spices and, and that so that's my goal so any help would be much appreciated and until next time I'll see you guys uh, take care